Well, good morning, guys. Hope you guys are having a great day. Today is Friday, and I have some <clears throat> not so exciting news. Um, let's see, can you see? Can you see how cold it is in my house? It's 59 degrees. You want to know why? Our heat's not working. It's just my freaking luck, guys. I swear to God. Um, yeah, yesterday it was on all day. Uh, Connor didn't feel like telling me this <laughs> was an issue yesterday morning. And we were sitting there. I I ran out yesterday. I had a lot of errands to do. I had to get my nails done. I went grocery shopping. went to a couple of stores to get some stuff. And I come back and I'm like, dang, it's cold in here. Like, well, I, I was running around so I was warm. But after, like, my body cooled down. I realized how cold it was in here. I was like, it's 63. Like, it was 63 last night. So I'm like, what the heck? So I tried playing with the heat, and it wouldn't turn on. So um, somebody should be coming out today to hopefully figure out what the heck is going on with that, because it's just ridiculous. I don't get it. Like, I didn't do anything. Um, it was working perfectly fine the last couple of nights, so I don't understand. So it's really annoying. Um, I just went to Home Goods opening, see if there was any Valentine's right on, and there wasn't any. Um, the girl that I'm friends with, she went to the store yesterday, and she got, like, a jackpot, so I was hoping that there would be something today, but there's some things that I wanted. I got a new blanket for the couch, um, and, like, a little floral piece to put on the, um, coffee table. But other than that, I got some totes. I'm going to take care of this stuff today. I promise you guys that, so... That is my plan. I'm going to put on, I don't know, something. You see these gray hairs, guys? I'm so old. Okay, so that's the plan. I'm going to make some coffee because your girl needs it. You can see the bags under my eyes. And I'm going to start getting, starting to hack away at this kitchen. I want it completely done today. And I should be fine. I should be able to do it. If I don't, I got issues.
and guys, I don't. Uh, I I don't know what the fuck's going on. So obviously, I was in the little Harry Potter closet. I'm trying to run my dishwasher. I ran it last night. Jesus Christ. I ran my. What the fuck just fell? Bunch of books. It smells like something's burning. So I ran my dishwasher last night. It's pretty self explanatory. You just press what cycle you want, you press start, it should work. Well, open up the, the dishwasher to. Dude, it smells like it's. Guys, I'm so freaking upset right now. I'm so hot. Even though it's like 60 degrees. Oh my god. I don't understand why this is just happening. Anyways, I ran the dishwasher last night and. I expected it to work. It made a noise, whatever. I opened it up today to put the clean dishes away. They're all dirty, so I'm going to rerun it again. And now it sound it smells like it's burning. I don't understand. Like I literally do not understand. I, I don't get it. What the fuck? I just don't understand why things can't be simple. Like I don't understand. breakdown he doesn't work dishwashers about to blow up like this is so stupid this is so dumb like I don't understand how I have this shitty of luck like this is just so dumb I mean it's a good thing that somebody's gonna be coming by later but like still like what the fuck? Like, I shouldn't have this many issues on my, f like, eighth day of being here. Like, this is so stupid. Like, what, what do I have to fucking do, man? Now I have the fucking door open. It's gonna cool down the house even more, but I need to get the burnt smell out of the house. Like, this is not what the fuck I signed up for. so irritating. Okay, so I figured out what that burning smell is. So, dishwasher, it literally won't even fill up with water. So, I don't understand that. But there's like this little like coil thing and it looks like it's, so the little patch or whatever, the dishwasher patch fell out normally and it should dissolve in water, but there's no freaking water in here. But it started burning on this little coil thing. So, Why is water not filling up in this? I don't get it. This is just my fucking luck, guys. Seriously, nothing can ever be freaking easy for me, I swear. flowers or something like right where the bottom of the cake stand is to kind of mask that I think that'd be a good idea and then I got the surf thing up there I think I'm gonna try and move it closer yeah 
actually one of you guys suggested to put books like go to a thrift store and get really cheap books and use as, them as risers which is actually a really good deal like a good idea so I forget your name but thank you so much for that I had an, a couple of extra books so that's what I did with like the enjoying family um so that's that I think I'm gonna try and use this um like oh it's a frame holder I'm gonna try and use that for the serve Okay, so definitely still a work in progress, but um, I don't know if I showed you guys this, but I did that up there, just a little barn and the farm fresh vase. I did stuff with this corner. I'm so short, you guys probably can't even see, but I do need to get some things to put under the cakes stand to kind of make it pop a little bit more. And I need to take off that, um, that bow on the eat canister. Then I have like my serve tray right above kind of like where all of that is and then I have my home sweet home planters I need to get some florals to put in there RMS RMS and then obviously I said I wasn't going to be decorating for Christmas but I don't know I have so much stuff that I need to do something with so I just did this little tiered tray it's still a work in progress I don't know how but I got this side right here I need a Maybe put some stuff over there. My Mary Birdhouse. My little canisters. That's a little hat for uh, my little reindeer that's over here. So I got my little reindeer. It's a little guy right there. He has a hat, but got my measuring cups, reindeer snacks, and then I need to put something in there. I don't know if I will this season just because Christmas, when I'm filming right now, Christmas is five days away, so that's going to be a negative Ghost Rider. Um, and then, yeah. I put my, it's kind of hard to see because of the, the lighting, but my love grows here right over my sink, which I think is really, really cute. I'm trying to sell those locally. Um, still have those guys. I don't know what I'm going to do with them yet. My tools, I don't know where to put them up there. Um, yeah, just a couple little minor things going on in the kitchen, and then I think I will be done with this for now um but yeah that's just a quick little overview it's definitely cleared out a lot um this used to be just completely full so yeah been kind of busy it's freezing in here it's 60 so it did go up a couple of degrees but yeah just wanted to fill you guys in on what i've done so far with the kitchen <gasps> My heat's finally back on. <laughs> it's slowly going up in temperature and it's amazing. It's 63. The guy was like, the guy was like, oh my gosh, it's so cold in here. How, why didn't you just call the emergency line? I was like, because I thought that I could deal with it overnight, which honestly I could because we were just hiding under the covers and it was, it was fine under the covers. But he's just like, yeah, next time if that ever happens, just call the emergency line because it it's freezing in here. So... Oh, yeah, I'm so thankful. I'm, like, standing underneath the heater right now. So, because, so I was, like, I don't, he came down and explained it. He's, like, yeah, um, both your heat's on. I was, like, I don't hear it, though. He's, like, oh, did they not explain how your vent works? And I was, like, no. So, we have one AC unit, and then there's two vents. So, we have a vent for upstairs. Like, we have two thermostats. So, there's a thermostat upstairs in our uh, master, and then one downstairs in the great room. And... If, they're, if both of them are on and both vents are heating both upstairs and downstairs, it's one vent that splits into two. So it it's going to take a little bit longer to warm up down here as opposed to just upstairs. But because, um, I don't know, you guys probably don't care. It's distributing 
the heat into two into two sections rather than just one. So that's why it's quiet and not pushing out as much. But oh my gosh, oh, I'm so excited that there's gonna be more soon. Okay, um, yeah. I should probably put this back on the kitchen. I needed to let the camera charge a little bit longer. Oh my gosh, but now I just want to wait until it gets warm. I'm so cold. Um, but I don't know when was the last time I showed you. I know I showed you all that up there. Um, I added some few, a few more things to my little thing right here. Um, it's got a lot of miscellaneous stuff. But I'm almost done with the kitchen, so. I mean, at least for now, obviously I'm going to be, you know, changing it up, like, nonstop. But I have a couple more totes that I can just put some stuff in. Um, maybe I'll do some sort of Christmas display. But I have so many freaking birdhouses. I need to find a solution for that. Ugh. What a problem. I remember literally forever ago I couldn't find a single birdhouse. And now I have... A lot. I have over 30. So, okay. Finally, we're getting somewhere. it was just it's like that but I'm okay with it whatever so red be mine I'm really into these tumblers because I make coffee every morning before I go to work and I bring these to work so I wanted the XOXO one so got that um, this bag is freaking heavy like I don't even remember what I bought I don't even, I don't even know Okay, actually, I know what this one is. So I got the XOXO canister. This is the last one that I need. Actually, I need the short red heart canister. That's the last one that I need. And the B Mine with the three little hearts. That one is gorgeous, guys. I'm obsessed with that. But this is the 2019. It's got so many dimples, guys. It is so cute. Can't really tell, but it's so freaking pretty. Oh my goodness, this. I got the bay mug, so <laughs> I wanted the babe mug. Actually, I did get it, so yeah, no. Yeah, I got the babe mug too. I just have to get it from another friend. But I thought the I I don't really say bay, but um I figured that like bay and babe next to each other next to each other would be so freaking cute and i absolutely love these little hearts at the bottom so i got that guy i didn't realize i got all the stuff i mean i should have known because my bank account's like empty got hot stuff because i thought this was amazing love this love this actually i think i got the tumbler that says it too but that's from another girl north that i got and then these are the candles. I got the candles too. So I got the pink Be Mine. These guys are freaking huge, but they actually, oh my God, they smell so, oh, it's Sweet Pea. 
Um, these were the big candles. These were $12.99 each, so hella expensive, but at least they smell good. I'm not, I wasn't a huge fan of any of the fall scents, but I still got candles. I didn't end up getting any Christmas candles this year, even though I wanted them. I just never ended up getting them. Maybe I'll look for them to see if they put them on clearance. If they do, then I'll fix them up for next year, but... I knew because I was going to move, I barely decorated for Christmas that I didn't want to get candles if I didn't need them. And then I got the red XOXO. Let me get closer. They have the stacked XOXO, but I wanted this one. Sparkling champagne. Smells good, though. And then I got one more. It's a red one. Pretty sure. No, it's a pink one. Oh. The pink love, I love the pink. If they come out with any pink canisters, I will literally crap myself. This one smells good. Midnight Rose. Actually, really enjoy all these scents, so yay. So excited for my little Valentine's Day haul. Um, I definitely know I have more stuff coming from somewhere. I don't know. I know I got the Babe mug. I got the Love Bug mug coming. Um. I got the hot stuff tumbler. I got a ceramic heart that lays on the side. I'm pretty sure it says love, if I remember correctly. Um, it's just a white one. And I think that's all I got for now. I think that's everything for this season of Valentine's. I could be wrong. I should probably check like my Facebook pay and everything. Cause there's gotta, I don't know. I don't know. Usually I'm pretty good about making a list of who I'm getting what from, but because of the move, like I hadn't really had much much time, so. Cool, just wanna show you guys uh, quickly what I got for Ray Dunn Valentine's. And yeah, um, I don't know if I showed you the kitchen officially, but I mean, this is still a hot mess over here that has money in it. I did get a um, money bank. Uh, uh, what is that? Piggy bank. But I actually have like cash cash in there and I just need to take that to the bank. That's a mess. This is just kind of like, that's a work in progress. My love grows here. Love that. Got a little, I don't know. I think I'm going to use that there. I love this paper towel holder. I got it from Home Goods. I didn't plan on putting this here, but actually it's not too bad. I might just keep it there for now. Still don't know what I'm doing with those yet. My baby canisters, they're just going to sit there for now. Hot cocoa because I didn't have anywhere else to put them. See, this is where I keep all my tumblers. I have a crap ton of them. I love them. Um, My canisters. That's not even half of my basics. And then this is what my little radon cabinet looks like with all of my dishes. These are bothering me. I wanted to put them like on my um, island, but I don't know what. It just didn't look right. So, I'm a little baking rolling pin. I got the hot stuff. I did actually leave it right here. It's a trivet. That's what it's for. But or trivet. I think that's how you pronounce it. Um, but I just got done cooking ramen, so I didn't actually want it to, <laughs> to get warm. So. Then I got my bananas in my little fruit bowl. So cute. Got rice. I put, ended up putting the rice cooker away. And then what's this cabinet look like? Oh, more mugs. Go figure. More mugs. Mugs galore. My little hat toppers. Hop a girl. Ma'am. What are you doing? And this is my pantry. So I did have. A lot of Halloween um, canisters down there. I had some Christmas canisters down there. That's a lot of just basic canisters. Um, actually, like that is a decal that I can't actually get off. So I think I just might keep the clear part on. I got all my little cellars back here. And then I got gumdrops and my cocoa canister. And some pictures down there. And then my crock, eggnog, yeah, so there's crap everywhere. So 
this is what I kind of have for my little Christmas display and I, I needed to get, I still need to get some stuff to put in there. I don't know if I will this year though. So I, like I said, I don't really see a point, but I got these, um, measuring cups. I love them. I love how, I like how my tiered stand came out. Got peppermint, my Merry Christmas canister. I just kind of alternated them. I got my coal canister, ho, 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 wish. Jingle, my Merry Bird House, and all my little Crocs, and my little Schnell, or my little reindeer. So, and then I just have this little Sleigh Bells ring sign down there, and then my Santa's workshop down there. I did kind of reorganize this. Honestly, I, I'm I'm just gonna keep it like this. I think it's just five days till Christmas, but this is what the top of that looks like. It, like I said, it's nothing extravagant. Just kind of wanted to tidy up a little bit. Um, this is just a freaking hot mess. Plus, it's got a Halloween uh, baking dish. And then I got some pie loaves. I got the, Santa, the baby Santa. And then two teapots. So that's being hidden by the Marion Bright sign. Because, yikes! Um, yeah, that's everything for now. I got their toys in there for Christmas. They don't know nothing about that though yet. And yeah, I have more canisters in here, more Christmas canisters. So I have Bat Humbug, I have Gingerbread, um, Jingle Believe, White Santa's Cookies, Jingle Bones. And yeah, that's everything. I, like I said, I'm gonna relax for the rest of the day. I'll probably put these. Fuck, I gotta find somewhere to put these. This is just never ending. Alright, uh, last vlog I think. I had shown you guys that I got these frames. Um, and these are like the little prints that I got. I'm just gonna put them in there now. Just so they're ready for whenever we decide to hang them. Maybe I can, maybe that'll help ignite Connor to start helping me with the house and decorating it and stuff. It's pretty much just me, so I want to show you guys what I'm doing right now.